In New York, the American Federation of Teachers leads a strike and gains a collective bargaining law and a strong contract. Inspired, California teachers begin to join the AFT too, although they could be fired just for belonging to a union. And we had tiny little unions. We had 10 people, 5, 15. And our message was always the same. Uh, we're here to start a union. And starting a union means that you're going to do it yourself. And I think people were scared. I was the AFT rep at North Hollywood High School. And I did not even know, or would I ask because it was too scary, who the members were. As Pasadena high school teacher Raoul Tillet recalls, It was like joining the French underground in Paris in 1943. We had more secret members than we had public members. Tillet, elected president of the California Federation of Teachers in 1968, gives voice to the feelings of thousands of teachers as collective bargaining comes to symbolize the dream for dignity in their workplace. In the classroom, we're worried about class size, teacher-pupil ratio, supportive auxiliary services within the classroom, an honest mechanism to assess students' needs and find out what they are and where the, what's needed. We were trying to build conditions for teaching to happen and learning to happen. Um, and we saw it as a social obligation for this to happen. Eventually, we realized it involved a lot of social issues. And that meant racism, that meant economics within society at large, that peace movement, a lot of things that were converging on the lives of young people. 